Doc, what was your reaction to the reaction to Paul, and why did you put him back in? Because the fans made me. <laughs> I mean, I'm no dummy. No, we're, I, I was going to anyway, uh, but, the, you know, um, you, you felt like the mob, you know, every time the game's over, then they kept pulling us back in, and you know, we kept getting the game close, and so, I mean, it was, the objective was to win the game, obviously, and um, we didn't do that. So, uh, once I thought the game was in hand to Boston, uh, we put him back in, and, and him making that shot just, um, that's just, I don't know what the heck that is. That's, that only happens like here, or I don't know what that is. I, I don't know who could sit that long, you know, and, and walk in on the floor and make a shot. I um, also thought it was really classy on uh, Brad, and, um, you know, it was a Marquette guy that gave up that shot. Uh, I think it was Jay Crowder. I think uh, it was Isaiah. Oh, was it Isaiah? Well, that, either way, it was it was phenomenal that, um, you know, take it. I mean, he was only a 40-footer, and he made it. So I, I just thought that that was, um, for Paul, that was perfect. That was perfect. And what about just the whole reaction the whole day? The crowd was amazing. They are amazing. You know, it's amazing how many of our players, you know, make comments about it. Like, wow, wow, this is, these people are amazing. Um, and they are. Um, and, you know, I, I said something before the game about Paul and it got emotional. Uh, it was just, it was awesome.